in the bigger picture, um, I want to step back and recognize this for what it is, an historic achievement for our two countries. As a first such determination, it's truly a historic achievement for the global organic community. Secretary Vilsack often reminds us that we need all kinds of agriculture in this century. He and I try to observe from the 30,000 feet foot high perspective. That's, that's our job. And what he says is we need to be concerned about more than 300 million Americans. We need to think about, this, you know, we have to think about the 6 billion people who live on the earth and the reality that the number will continue to grow. The capacity to produce food, food assistance, and access to food through trade are all critical to food security. Organic agriculture is part of this equation. And with this determination of equivalency and continued advancements um, in the organic movement, it will be. Today, we're taking that first step toward global harmonization of organic standards as the world's two largest trading partners come together. So each of you here today has worked so hard for the growth of the organic sector and has you have every reason to be very proud of it. I want to offer my personal thanks to Barbara Robinson and everyone in USDA has pushed forward with the conviction that this goal was achievable and vital to the organic sector and world trade. So congratulations and thank you.